Happy holidays. I'm Chris. This is my lovely daughter, Lana. Today we're gonna be trying some stash teas. It's a variety box, a holiday box. So we're gonna be trying some holiday teas and giving our review and thoughts on it. This is a great gift for like coworkers, um, friends, family, if they love tea. That's what the box looks like. Now that's what's inside. Comes with some honey. These are some honey straws. And we have eight. There's eight different teas in the box. We're gonna try each one of them for you and give you our honest opinions. I am an avid tea drinker. Um, my daughter, not so much. So you get a person who loves tea and someone who kind of is eh about it. We're gonna get started. Um, I'll let you pick which one we're gonna try first. We got our water warmed up already. Maple apple cider. We're going to be trying the maple apple cider. It's a caffeine free tea. You want to tell us what the ingredients are? It's rubus, hibiscus, cinnamon, natural maple flavor, natural apple flavor, natural caramel flavor, and citric acid. All right. And um, usually we're just going to let it steep for maybe five or so minutes. Um, most herbal teas, you can let them steep up until 15 or so. This is three to five. Oh, it has it on there? How long? Oh, oh, I bet. It says three to five minutes, so. Three to five. If you are like a lighter tea, which if you don't like tea, you're probably gonna go the lighter route, so maybe three minutes. It smells really good. Oh, that's a good sign. Mmm, it does. I hope it tastes like apple pie. And we're going to be brave and have her try them with no sugar, no additives at all. So you can get just a true response, I guess. Um, I don't put anything in my teas, but of course, if you like honey or sugar, that's okay too. Or both. Um, or both, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but since we're trying so many, we're gonna just kinda go through it. But if you think it would taste like good if it had the sugar and stuff, then Definitely let us know. You definitely smell the apple, like. Mm. It smells like warm apple cider. You know what it makes me think about that oatmeal, Quaker oatmeal, that quick instant Quaker apple oatmeal with the apple and cinnamon. That's what it smells like to me for some reason. All right, Lana, I'm ready. Are you ready? I suppose. Oh, okay. <laughs> Too hot. <laughs> I can, you know what? I can taste the maple in it. Now that I taste it, I forgot it said um, maple. It's maple apple cider. I forgot it said that, but now I'm definitely smelling and getting that maple. What do you think? Don't taste good. It tastes like, um, it tastes exactly like what it's called, the um, maple apple cider. It tastes like that. I am not a major apple cider fan. I'd drink this. You would? I can't taste anything, so yeah. <laughs> so Lana likes it. This it smells like, uh, it definitely you know, it smells good. really good and it yeah. tastes like warm water. <laughs> I can could, I could taste the flavors in it, um, and it's okay, but it's not one of my top favorites um, of flavors, so. I would drink this. Well, it's good. Okay. Yeah. Good, good. So one for one. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next cup. You can finish your cup. <laughs> I'm gonna pick out a flavor at least. All right, so this one is a decaf pumpkin spice, and I love just about anything pumpkin spice, so. I'm hoping that's really good. You ready for some pumpkin spice, Lana? Pumpkin spice. Decaf. Decaf pumpkin spice. And this is a black tea, as mentioned. So we're gonna steep this for about three minutes. I like to smell the bags before I put them in water. Yeah. Oh, you do? Mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> no. No? No. I love it. No. Oh. It's the decaf. It smells like everything. I smell the decaf. Everything I want it to smell like. It smells like pumpkin spice. And the flavors in this one are a decaf black tea, cinnamon, ginger, um, some natural pumpkin spice flavor, cloves, and allspice. It's great for pregnant women. Why is that? It has ginger and it's decaf. Oh, okay. Probably good for nausea. And Lana just had a baby. We're gonna have to show to you guys later. And we're gonna ring if we like it and if we don't. It smells spicy. Oh my God, it smells so good. It smells spicy. It does smell spicy. Pumpkin spicy. It tastes spicy. Does it? Mm -hmm. I haven't even took a sip yet. Like the smell is just so. It's spicy. It's my everything. Me. <laughs> Let's see if we get to try it. Just <laughs> taste Alright, so you can give it a go. I love this. It tastes exactly like I would want it to taste. I would probably let this sit in there a little longer because I like like the strong smell of pumpkin spice. And it hasn't like sat long enough. No? Mm -mm. Yes. Throw the whole cup away. <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's so good. This is the one I was sitting during. Really? Nah. Oh, that's good. Mm. It just makes you think of fall and like sweater weather and cozy socks and it didn't give you any of that. All right, let's move along. Mmm. Your choice. I choose this one. I choose you, cinnamon vanilla. I was gonna say you. Oh. Cinnamon vanilla. Yep. Oh, it almost went. There we go, cinnamon vanilla. It has cinnamon, rubus, chamomile. I don't like none of these things. I what love all it. What? what is that? There's the Perula. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it sounds like it says. Sarsa Perula. And natural vanilla flavor. So I'm not sure what that flavor is either. Um, Rubis is a, a tea itself. Chamomile, I love chamomile. Um, this might be, it might be a good like bedtime tea. Mm. Um, yeah, and it's a herbal tea, so no caffeine. caffeine. Yep. Something you might even want to give like the kids right before bed. Knock you out. It's strong. Oh, it is. Ooh. But strong vanilla though. Now, I already know I am not a fan of warm vanilla anything. Not the lotion, not. No, I don't like warm vanilla lotion. I like don't. anything warm vanilla, a candle, anything. So I know as soon as I put water, hot water on top of <laughs> it, I'm probably not gonna like it, but I'm gonna go in with an open mind okay. and see what it do. At least I do smell a lot of the cinnamon. Really? I do. I smell the vanilla, but it doesn't smell like one of those warm vanillas, which is good. It makes me think of French toast sticks. Like, well, French toast or French toast sticks, whatever. Like, that's what I always like to make on Christmas morning anyway. So it really just made me think of like, yeah, that morning, you know? Like the bowl of mix, not the finished product. Uh, okay. <laughs> I think I'm getting a whiff of like a cinnamon, the cinnamon roll before it's cooked. I'm just thankful that the cinnamon overpowers the vanilla for me. You want me to go first? No, because I can't trust your judgment. 
the taste is fine, but the taste combined with the smell when it hits my nose when I go up, I can't. I won't can't be able it. to drink it all the time. You don't think if you added sugar, it would taste like the, a cinnamon bun or anything? Maybe. So. But the taste is tolerable. But I, so I bet if you added some sugar. I just think the vanilla is too strong when it hits my nose. Oh, okay. I'm gonna do a side. Like I feel like um, if you don't add additives to the tea, which like I said, there is it's a personal choice and lots of people do, but if you don't, like if you're on a diet or if you like just craving something sweet, but you don't really want something sweet for your own personal reasons or whatever, I think it's a good choice. Or you can say F it and just put a couple spoons of sugar in it and have a good day and enjoy it. Like a cinnamon bun, yeah. And the more you steep it, the longer you leave this in, it gets stronger, on. yeah. Okay, fine. I like it. Hey. I really like this one. I, I didn't think I would, but I, I, it's, it's actually a pleasant surprise. Hmm. Okay, so we're gonna try the one that made me buy the box. And I've never tried it before. It is called Christmas in Paris. And that is the whole reason I was like, I'm trying this box just for the title of the tea. I have no idea what it tastes like, but I freaking love and adore Paris. It's one of my favorite things. And thinking about Christmas in Paris, I was sold. This is a herbal tea. It has cocoa shells, peppermint, lavender, chocolate, and vanilla. That sounds interesting anyway. I'm hoping I love this. It sounds like a wood. What about it makes it Paris? The pepper? No, the <laughs> lavender. It's the lavender. Because everything else was normal. Okay. What about the cocoa and the... It just makes me think maybe oh. it tastes like a... <coughs> 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 so good but you know what the first the first 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 instinct was um a thin mint so the the chocolate and the and the cocoa and Your the peppermint, peppermint patty. yeah that yes a thin mint or a peppermint patty it's probably more like a peppermint patty you're right and it smells so good oh my god i don't like york you don't you don't like no ma'am oh my god i'm good on that one Mm, I'm so ready to try this one. You enjoy that. You're gonna try it. So you're gonna put your tea bag right on in here. No ma'am. <laughs> I'm pulling the mom car. All right then. <laughs> mm. Oh my God, I cannot wait to try this. Don't I you can. like peppermint? I don't like the smell. Don't Peppermint's really. one of my favorite flavors. I don't really care for peppermint. I'm not a big chocolate fan, but I like it when it's with mint, for some reason. Peppermint mm. and chocolate. That's all I, I want to smell the lavender. Maybe lightly, but. I hope it lives up to be what you're making it out. <laughs> I wish I could be drinking this in Paris. Mm. <laughs> but this will have to do. Ready? Oh, wait. <laughs> I feel like it hasn't steeped long enough. We're hand steeping. <laughs> Your hand getting like mm. a sauna. Clean me. <laughs> it's like you could get a facial. Oh no man. Not with that smell. <laughs> Alright. Mmm. Mmm. 
I just wish it was stronger. Like I'd have to really like, I think it would be so good if I was doing this correctly and like letting it steep for a while, like covered and everything for a while. And obviously for the purpose of this video, we're kind of moving along quickly. It tastes like we want peppermint pie. But it's really good. It's really good. That's what it tastes like. New York peppermint yeah. patty. So if you like your peppermint patty, or it's for you. It's for you. And it's for me. And we should go together to Paris and have a cup. <clears throat> right. We're leaving you here. That's fine. Go ahead, shake your little thing. It's a yes for me. All right, what are we going for now? Um, this one is called Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve. It has cinnamon. Do all of these have cinnamon? I don't know, it's, there, it's a holiday box, so maybe. Cinnamon, spearmint, orange mm. peel, vanilla, mm. orange oil, natural cinnamon, and clove bud oil. Is it a bite tea? Herbal. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Do you not like spearmint either? It just, it instantly made me want to go. Yes. And just start chewing it. Smells like spearmint gum. Mm. Mom! Oh, this is good. It tastes just like spearmint. Mm -hmm. Like, just like it. Did it have anything else in it? Did we read Orange it? stuff oh, and vanilla. Yeah. It's really good, really good. I think this might be my favorite. Really? So far, yeah. This is more my speed if I was actually buying teas and stuff. I would, yeah, I like it a lot. Yes, it's okay. Okay. Yeah, I think this is my last one though. Yeah. Yeah. So Lana is saying that she is tapping out from tea. Yeah. So um, we had three more flavors to try, which is Christmas morning. This one is has black teas and a green jasmine tea. That's it, those are the flavors. Um, there was a cranberry pomegranate, okay. And that one, it has hibiscus, rubus, cranberry and pomegranate and then the last one would have been a holiday chai is it in there? Mm -hmm. okay and this one is a black tea it has cinnamon allspice cloves ginger root gingerbread and a jamaican rum mm, with a little bit of nutmeg that sounds kind of good and i like chai tea too so those are the ones that, those are the other ones that come in the box. I think this is a absolute great holiday gift. Um, I would absolutely love it as a tea drinker. I got this off of Amazon. I don't remember how much it was, but happy holidays. <laughs>